explain myself And I just threw this clip in because my little brother said he wanted to post it up and get YouTube famous real quick. Yep, everybody sees it. I thought it was bad when it first happened, but I guess it wasn't that bad. But it just looked super bad to me. And this whole bumper, like I said... I mean, I'm sorry, like I posted uh, about a week ago, we changed the whole front bumper on it, and it looked all right on it, and I said it was going to get painted and everything, but now I have to get a whole nother bumper, take it to the body shop, they got to put a new bumper on it, and then the hood is bent in right here, it's creased right here, and then it's beat up right here, scratched, dented in right here, and smashed in round right here, R smashed in and rounded right here, so... Man, I just can't win for losing, it seems like it. The ticket, then this. But the ticket was preventable, preventable, and this could have been prevented also, but it was my fault for not checking when somebody drove my car. It ran up on an F-250. Super duty. It was a nice one. It was burgundy. But let me pop the hood and show you. Oh. Oh, yeah. I don't have to pop the fucking hood. Nah, this is all I have to do. You see this? We'll push down on it. Slide my hand up on it. You see? That right there. That's pushed in that way. What is this? The hood latch? The hood latch, it has to be pushed down some. Yeah, the hood latch has to be pushed down. But this right here, I'm sure it can be bent back, but it's aggravating, y'all. It's very, very aggravating. But that's life. It'll go on. And this got beat up pretty bad, I think. Right here. Well, I think that's made like that, but can y'all see that? We try to push all that stuff back in, and it just kept coming out. But check it out right here at this view. Look at that. Man. It's just plastic. That's the bad thing about it. The whole thing will have to be replaced. Because it's a whole one piece, of course, but it is what it is. Look at this play. <sighs> I don't know. I'm going to take it to the body shop, get an instrument on it, and see how much it will cost. God, that hood is caved in. I don't know what to do. This is very, very aggravating. But... Life goes on, maybe that's a sign, but it's going to go on. Uh, this Camaro is going to be a badass shortly. Just got to give it some time. <laughs> Catching up on some stuff that I got to do. But that's what's going on today. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I was crying. I know it's not that serious, and it's not, it's not that bad. But me, I was crying. Everybody's like, why Why are you crying? I'm like, everything is just happening at one time. And it's just frustrating. Can't get it right. But everybody was like, life goes on. I was like, yeah, you're right. So I got over it, stopped crying. I was like, I started cracking jokes. Uh, then everything got, got to be okay. But <sighs> it was tough. It was a... It was my fault, but just don't let other people drive your stuff. Yep. Thing that happened is the parking brake was not set. Got in the car. My fault. Wasn't looking. Crunk it up. I think the car was in gear or something like that. But I don't know how you can cut it off and crank it up with the car in gear. But it is what it is. 
mess up. So people are saying the damage isn't that bad, but they didn't see that this right here was creased in. I don't know what to do. We did, we called the police. He said it wasn't over a thousand dollars worth of damage. To him, it didn't look like it. I was like, whatever, I just called my insurance company and uh, go through them and get it fixed. But man, that really hurt my feelings, but it's okay. Um, <sighs> we'll get it fixed. Hopefully it'll be looking better than brand new. So maybe, maybe I can just switch out the bumper to it. I don't know. Delete all that in the middle right around there. Delete all that. I don't know. Billet. Make it billet. Black billet. Well, I'm sorry, matte black. Cause I don't look, I don't like this. But anyways, it's all right for now. But um, that's the update on the Camaro. I'm sorry I didn't post a video this weekend. I did a better job at least posting one video a week. But um, that's everything, everybody. I'm sorry <laughs> about being so boring lately. But I've just been like, ugh. I don't know what's been wrong with me. Maybe just weather. Maybe it's that. But I will get back to posting videos on a weekly basis. I could not think of the word. On a weekly basis, I'll be posting videos. So, that's it, everybody. Uh, comment below. Tell me uh, anything, has anything bad like this happened to you? Like, it's just like everything is messing up at one time. <sighs> or any little nicks you got like this and or this, can anybody tell me if I can get these creases? No, nah, no, nah, never mind. But if anybody has any ideas, if we could just pop these creases out, which I doubt, because that seems very, very soft. How's it look up in there? Yeah, that bumper's gone. But the radiator wasn't damaged or anything. It's drivable. We drove it back home. But this is busted right here. So we have to get that fixed. But, um, yeah. Please, everybody let me know. Um, it's going to get better for me. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm going to keep saying. Uh, everything is going to be be great pretty soon. So, um, comments. Let me uh, know some comments. Uh, like it and subscribe to my channel. Please subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to get more subs than my brother. Uh, by the end of this year, I'm trying to have at least 500 subscribers. So please subscribe to my channel and give my video a thumbs up, if you don't mind, please. But um, that's it, and I uh, hope everyone has a great day, and see y'all later.